So the primary symbol of Cascadia is the Cascadia Doug flag. And I really, you know, I love this symbol um, so much. It was designed in 1994 by a geography um, professor in Portland named Alexander Beretic. And I think what I really love about it is it is just a symbol for the bioregion. And so it's green for the forests, white for the mountains, and then blue for the, well, our occasional blue skies, but also our uh, rivers and oceans. And, uh, and then in the middle is a Douglas fir, which is kind of a beautiful symbol for the bioregion because it grows throughout the entire extent and through the watersheds. And, um, and I think what's important to realize is a lot of people are curious of, of why we chose a, you know, a flag as a symbol or a symbol as a flag. And what I love is, is it's just a representation of the landscape. It's nothing more than that. And so similar to how a rainbow flag can uh, represent not a nationalistic idea, but principles and something positive that we really identify and associate with, um, the Doug flag provides kind of a base where we can kind of come together and coalesce. And you can see other people out there who have the same principles and ideas that you also might have and that, you know, are kind of working around this concept. And I think what's really powerful about that is that as a symbol, it's not just a flag. Hopefully it'll be one flag of many different flags. There should be a flag for every different bioregion and a flag for every different ecoregion. And maybe it's not even a flag. Maybe it's, uh, you know, a blanket or something more than that. More than just a flag, it's, it's, it's a symbol and a representation. I think some of my favorite stories are people who are driving and they're driving down the, you know, they're going camping or they're uh, driving home and then they just slam on their brakes and kind of pull over um, off to the side of the road and they look and they snap a picture and they're like, there it is, there's the Cascadia flag. And it's awesome because it's literally just mountains and water and sky and a Douglas fir kind of, you know, standing through. And so um, for me, I love that. It's, a, you know, it's important for, uh, to have a, a symbol for um, bioregional solidarity and diversity. Um, and it's not, you know, the symbol, but rather one of many. And hopefully every different movement and every different community um, can have their own symbol and those symbols together get to make up the actual dialogue and narrative for what Cascadia gets to be. And that's something that we get to all create together.